use place value to write whole numbers, we also call that in standard form. We will now write a number given in words as digits, again, which we call standard form. How do we go about this? We're going to use place value to write a whole number in standard form. Step one is that you want to identify the words that indicate the periods. And remember that the ones period is never named. Step two, draw three blanks to indicate the number of places needed in each period. Separate the periods by commas. Step three, we're going to name the number in each period and place the digits in the correct place value position. So for example, we want to be able to write the following numbers in standard form. Again, using digits. We have 53,401,742. The first thing is, is that we need to identify the words that indicate the periods. So the first one is millions followed by the comma, so therefore there is our first period. The second one is thousand followed by the comma, and therefore the next period is thousands. And the next one is, not, as remember, the ones period is never named, so therefore we have the ones. Now, how is it written in the first period, in the, in the millions period? It is 53 million, so we have 53 million followed by the comma. And then we have 401,000 followed by the comma. And then we have 742 for the final period of ones. Okay, now, except for the first period, again, all other periods must have three places. Now we're going to draw three blanks to indicate the number of places needed in each period. So what we're going to do now is we're going to draw three blank spaces. Okay. So there are our three blank spaces. Okay, and I'm going to move these down just a little bit more so we can create a little bit more room. Okay, so if we take a look at the first one here, it says 742. So we know that this is going to have 742, and then we have a comma here. The next one is we have 401,000. So 401 is written as 401, and then we have our comma. And then the last one is 53 million, so we only have 5 and then 3. And so therefore, put the numbers together, including the commas, the number is 53, 401, 742, which is 53,401,742. Okay, now we're going to do the same thing. For the next example, which says 9,246,073,171 ,189. So again, let's identify the words that indicate the period. So we have the first period, which is billions, and the next period is millions, and the next period is thousands, and then the last period is ones. Now again, underneath that, we're going to write down the number in each particular period. So we have 9 billion, comma, and then there's 246 million, comma, there's 73,000, comma, and then there's 189. Okay, so again, except for the first period, all other periods must have three places. So we're going to draw three blanks to indicate the number of places needed in each period. And then we're going to separate the periods by commas and then write the digits in each period. So we have three blank spaces here. And then we have three blank spaces here. We have another three blank spaces here and then three blank spaces there. So starting with the ones period, we have 189. So that means we have 189 in the ones period, and then we have our comma. The next thing we have is 73,000. So keep in mind here that we have 73,000. So we have seven, three, 
okay? And we also need to put the zero in as a placeholder. So we gotta make sure that we put in that placeholder here for the zero. And the next period in the millions is 246. So we have 246. And again, don't forget those commas. And then we have our comma here. And then we have 9 billion. So we have 9. Since that is the last one on the left, we do not have to put the zeros in for the placeholders. But anywhere in between, we should. So therefore, the number is 9, 246, 073, 189. And remember, this is written as 9 billion. 246,073,189. Now again, notice that in part B, again, we had the zero here, okay, was needed as a placeholder in the hundred thousands place. So be sure to write zeros as needed to make sure that each period, except possibly the first, as we noted, has three places.